Hi YouTube, my name is Chef Preciosa for those who don't know. I know it's been a while, but today we're making loaded seafood chowder. So let's get started. You want to start off by soaking all your seafood in cold water, apple cider vinegar, lemon juice, and salt. Then you want to peel your shrimps and all your other seafood. Once you're done peeling all your seafood, you want to place it in a bowl together. we can start chopping our celery carrots and potatoes then placing them in the same bowl together You'd need to mince some garlic and cut some onions as well and place them in a bowl to the side. Put some butter in a pan, then let it heat up. Then you add all your seafood and season it. You can use the same seasoning I used or season your seafood however you like to season your seafood. After you're done seasoning your seafood, start really good. Don't let it cook all the way through. Then once you're done, place the pan to the side. Add 
add some olive oil to your pot, let it heat up, then add your onions, garlic, and let it brown a little bit. Once you're done letting it brown a little bit, then you add your celery, carrots, and potatoes. Add some flour, then you stir it around. Then you can add some pepper, salt, onion powder, and garlic powder, clam juice, and chicken stock, and stir it a little bit. After you're done stirring, add fresh bay leaf and thyme. Then cover it for about 20 minutes and stir periodically. Then you want to stir in your heavy cream and put your top back on for about another 20 minutes. Now it's time to add your seafood. Then you can splash a little bit of hot sauce in it, stir it around, let it simmer for about another five minutes. Now that your chowder is done, now you can get a bowl of butter and shave some onions and garlic into it and then mix it together and place it to the side. I also added a pinch of garlic powder and onion powder to the butter mix. This butter mix is for your baguette bread. You can buy it at the store or make it. I made my own. If you want to learn how to make it, please comment below. Spread some olive oil and the butter mix on both sides of your baguette bread. Then you will grill both sides of your baguette slices for about five minutes. Now it's time to enjoy your chowder and your baguette bread. I hope you guys enjoyed this recipe. Please like, share, and subscribe to my YouTube channel for more cooking tutorials. And add me on my other social media platforms. Thank you.